Good morning, Hank. It's Tuesday. Today's video is like the last season of Game of Thrones. It comes to you in seven parts and will be filmed partially in absolute darkness. Part one, so listen, I have to go to the hand doctor because my finger isn't working for reasons hopefully unrelated to the fact that I've signed my name over 500,000 times in the last 10 years and need to sign it a further 100,000 in the next three months, so let's go on an adventure. Part two, the 2021 Project for Awesome is coming soon. It will go from noon on February 12th to noon on February 14th. Quick backstory, the Project for Awesome is a 48-hour live stream extravaganza, fundraiser, and celebration of efforts to decrease Earth's overall worldwide level of suck. I'm being lit entirely by my phone, by the way. We got a lot of darkness here in Indiana in January. In fact, you know what? Let's wait for the sunrise. Filling out some paperwork containing information that the doctor's office should already know. Right, so during the first half of the Project for Awesome, we raise unrestricted funds for pre-selected charities. This year, Partners in Health and Save the Children, two organizations our community has worked with for over 10 years. And then during the second half of the Project for Awesome, we raise money for charities chosen by you. In fact, if you make a Project for Awesome video about your favorite charity, tens of thousands of dollars could go to that charity, but more on that in a moment. Part three, an explanation. So we moved the timing of this year's Project for Awesome because one, the holiday season is pretty crowded, and two, as you may be aware, 2020 was a bit of a mess. Related, a few perks from the last Project for Awesome still haven't gone out, which I'm really, really sorry about. The P4A is an all-volunteer operation, and so shipping often takes a while, but COVID profoundly affected our ability to manufacture and ship perks, and I'm sorry, and we think we have it figured out, and it's going to be better this year. Part four, we need matching donors. Now, we know that many of you have donated very generously to our project in Sierra Leone, and that many more of you are not in a position to donate, and we get that. There are many other ways to be involved in the Project for Awesome. See part five. But if you can afford to donate $500 or more to this year's Project for Awesome, please join our matching fund. There is a simple and easy Google form in the doobly-doo, and also you can just email us. Matching donors help everyone else's donations go further and are a big part of the reason why over the last 10 years, the Project for Awesome has been able to donate over $10 million to charity. So, thank you. Great news, I don't have arthritis, I have a sprained ligament, so I'm fine to power through. All right, let's go home. Part five, you should make a Project for Awesome video where you introduce us to an organization you care about and make the case that they are doing good and important work that our community should support. People can then watch and vote for your video at Project for Awesome Awesome.com, which will help inform which charities get the money raised during the second half of the Project for Awesome. So even if you can't donate, you can potentially raise lots of money for organizations you care about. But this year, Project for Awesome videos must be uploaded to YouTube and submitted at ProjectForAwesome.com at least 48 hours before the P4A actually starts so that our community can have more time to watch and share videos, more info in the doobly-doo. Part six, perks. As always, there will be lots of great perks available if you donate. Like, no spoilers, but Sarah has been making these amazing collages from old magazines. Oh, and also because we're working with the donation platform Tiltify, we can finally accept PayPal donations! It only took 14 years. Part 7, The Closing. Hank, I am so looking forward to this year's Project for Awesome. It's always such an encouragement, something I really need right now, and also it reminds me what our little video blog project is ultimately about. As it says on my 2021 vision board, more awesome, less suck. Hank, I'll see you on Friday.